Alrighty, so an update on the 74 Corvette project. New rubber. She's been washed, got the T-tops off. I actually got her out for a drive today. I finished the exhaust, which comes out as squares right there, as you can see. And still winking, still gotta fix that. Under hood improvements. All right, everything is painted kind of nice. There are now headers. Don't know if you can see them. There we go. New spark plugs, new wires. Debating whether or not to throw all that chrome stuff back on top. There's a new cap, there's a new rotor, and I installed a Pertronics igniter in place of the old point system. Should probably get that ugly, uh, ugly old coil out of there too and probably replace it with a Pertronics flamethrower maybe. Kind of go really nice with it. Get in the shade. All sorts of shiny stuff. There's the headers. This side went in real easy. The other side was kind of a bear. And everything's running out of that three inch collector right there. Into two and three quarter inch. I've got a couple resonators from work that I picked up. And then she goes into a three inch pipe and out into these four squares, two on each side. She sounds freaking gnarly. And I like it. More new rubber. Definitely needed that. So now that she's all cleaned up, you can see I have some more cut out for me. There's a crack there in the paint. Hopefully it's not in fiberglass. But yeah, making headway on her. Still a four speed, got a bunch of work to do in the interior. She's still kind of messy. So that will be next on the project. Let's see, get her started up for y'all. So you can hear it. Ugh. smooth before. I'm kind of digging that uh, igniter. I don't think she's ever started that easy before either. But that's what she sounds like coming out of her. I haven't done anything with the interior on the engine yet. Don't know if I'm gonna at this point. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. Thanks for watching, catch you all later.